never did that. Mm -hmm. I was just messaging him because I wanted money. So I'm like, let me flirt back and forth with him to see if I can get money. And I did, so that was whatever, mm -hmm. but it's like, I never- Go to his only fans. I don't know exactly which one is his account because Go to it's, it. it's anonymous. Go to it. You do, know, you know. No, I don't. Go to I, it. Do you want me to, me to message to it. him? Back in Houston. No, I don't want to lose you. Okay, get off of me. I don't want to lose you. I don't, don't want to lose you. No, because you, it, you... I'll, I'll send you $10,000. Send it right now. She's earning that type of money and she's acting that suspicious. I can only assume she's probably got an OnlyFans or she's an escort or something. If someone's acting that guilty when you find their phone and they're literally grabbing on your leg, offering you money to stay. That means they've done something unforgivable. Don't bother, you gotta leave. Now if he took the 10 grand and he left, they'll still find a way to make him look like the villain. But you know damn well if it was the other way around, if it was a girl that had been cheated on and she got the 10 grand from her guy, they'd all be saying, girl power, you're a queen. I'm not saying he should have taken the money, but I'm not gonna blame him if he did either. As long as he didn't go back to her and he sent her where she belongs. She belongs to the streets.